Hey everybody, it's Erin. Today we're going to make some cute little wine cork turkeys. These were made by our lovely assistant Catherine and her friend. Girls, want to wave hi on the camera? Come over here and say hi. Hello, my name is Catherine. Okay, so they made these two fun little ones, which means little kids can do them too. They are five and almost six for the other one. And they turned out absolutely adorable. All right, so to start off how to do this, all I did is I took some wine cork bottles, some wine, some not bottles, some corks that come from wine bottles, and then we cut them into thirds. And I've done both the ones that are kind of the plasticky ones and also the true cork, and they both work just fine. These ones are all made with the cork, but these ones are made with the more plastic looking one, the faux cork, whatever it is. So once you have your disc, the next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna make your feathers, and it's really quite simple. You take a little bit of felt, and I just picked a few fun colors, and I'm going to do a feather of each in each of the colors. So I have a brown, I have a darker brown, and then I have three colors of green. And then we also have a orange for the nose. So for the nose, all you need is some sort of fun little triangle. There's no right or wrong way, so we're going to make this guy look a little bit longer. And I'm going to cut the other feathers real fast for the turkey out of the other colors. What I have right here is I have the Xyron one and a half. No, this is the three inch. I can't think of measurement state. This is a three inch sticker maker. And when I did all the pump, when I did all the turkeys, I actually ran all of the colors in at one time. But for just doing a single turkey, I'm just going to run them all at the same time. I take the widest, the bottom of the triangle for the feathers and run it through. So just take the bottoms of the triangles, stick them in. And then I'm gonna take my little nose, stick it in. And it's easier to do the bottom of the triangle by pushing it in there and then pull. And you're gonna see that it's gonna get caught. For the eyeballs, what I do is I kind of open up the edge until I can kind of reveal where the sticky is. And I just take my little eyeball and as best as you can, just place it on there. It's gonna get caught onto the sticky, just like that. We're turning everything into a sticker, which makes my job a whole lot easier. Pull it off. And that's about the hardest that you have to do for this. Pull off the front cover, the front plastic. And here's the next step. Make sure your fingers are not sticky. So if you have any excess little glue pieces, Felt wants to stick to felt, and it also wants to stick to anything that is sticky, including if you've got anything on your fingernails. So make sure that your hands are nice and clean. Decide what you want to have as your front and your back. I'm going to call this my front, and it's okay if there's a hole, because guess what? We are going to pull off and put our little nose right on top of that hole. So in order to get the sticky to stick to the felt, because sometimes things don't like to stick to felt, you're going to pull up the top of the triangle, and then you're going to drag and when you drag, you're dragging the sticky and you can still see, you can actually kind of see it. So it's stuck on there. Take it to the back side and place your first, fe first feather. Now, if you have any kind of loose, just use your finger and kind of clean it up a little bit. And it is on there. Do the same thing for the others. And I didn't really put that on there. I, I like doing the colors where they're a little bit different. So I'm actually gonna place the green as my top. So I'm going to rearrange this. See, it sticks to my fingers. <laughs> I got sticky on my finger and I don't need it there. So make sure, see, there's the sticky right there. Got to get that off. All right. So I'm going to take my next green, drag it, make sure the sticky is on the felt. This time I'm going to go to this side. Pull off. This is why my fingers get sticky is because I'm pulling off an excess stick. Okay. And there they go. Now I'm going to do the other brown. And if you feel like they're just too long or they're not quite where you want them to be, you can trim them up at this point, push everything down. Next thing you're going to do, and this is going to help hold everything together as well, is you're going to get some magnet tape. And this is from Xyron. It's just called magnet tape. It's pretty cool stuff. And you layer it and then you stick it to the cork as well. So notice how we had a little bit of a gap. The whole thing is going to become a giant magnet. Line it up so that you have it in the direction you want push it all down and then the excess you're just going to trim off the bottom all right so now once you have the back on there flip it over and now it's time to work on the fronts again use the sticky to your benefit pull it off and apply your little nose 
There we go. And then we're gonna take off our little googly eyes. Take the last little googly eye off, kind of pull it so the sticky stays on here, and then just place it on. And your nose gives your care gives your turkey a little bit of character, which is kind of fun. So now we have some cute little turkeys ready for Thanksgiving. Fun little things, just using some felt, probably some stuff you already have in the house. If you do not have googly eyes, you can easily just take a white pen and do the white and put a black dot. But I think the googly eyes really do add a little bit of character and kind of some fun to the whole thing. Definitely a fun kids craft. Girl Scouts, Boy Scouts, at school, something kind of cute and fun using supplies that you probably already have. So thanks for stopping by. Thanks, please subscribe and I'll see you guys again soon. Bye-bye.